this is the solution to homework seven, written homework seven. Okay, so according to definition, this is negative 64 to one third squared. That's the definition of, of that statement. Uh, so this is equal to the cube root of negative 64 is negative 4. And then we square that. Well, negative 4 squared, that's 16. So that's the answer to part A. Negative 64 to 3 halves, by definition, is negative 64 to 1 half to 3. Well, if that's not clear, recall that fractional exponent 1 half is square root. So what's being requested is the square, square root of 64 cubed. This is not defined. Because uh, square root is an even radical, and it requires a non-negative argument. OK, uh, for this one, OK, so that's fifth root of 1, 0, 2, 4, and c to 10. So we need to break things into groups of 5. So 1, 0, 2, 4, that's, that's actually uh, 2 to 10. And then that's c, it, that, the other thing is exactly c to 10. So then we could write this as fifth root of 2 to 5 multiplied by 2 to 5 multiplied by c to 5 multiplied by c to 5. So we've grouped these in five, so that's two, 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 and another two, 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 and then similar for the C's. So all of these can come out. So it will be that two to five comes out as two, that two to five comes out as two, that C to five comes out as C, and that C to five comes out as C. So the answer is for c squared. And that's the answer.